dancing, guys. <laughs> Have you seen one of these things before, everybody? Like in the big parking lots. Christy gave me this because she knew I'd like it. I could sit here. <laughs> it's perfect. Dance. Dang it. Dance for your priest. Or not. Maybe turn him off. Give him a okay. break. He's not. He's gone. <clears throat> so, what's up, everybody? It's Father Jerry. It's on Wednesday, um, the eve of the eve of Christmas. So it's great. And you know what? I'm going to tell you something. Um, it's the little things, I think, that really matter sometimes. Or at least they should. Because the little things are important. Um, the little gifts. The little um, <clears throat> pieces of chocolate. <clears throat> even the little, little Father Jerry. I don't know if I've ever shown you all this before on a video before, but uh, my nephew Brandon and Nicole, who were here in the parish, when they got married, which I did their wedding, we priests always say, um, <clears throat> I don't marry anyone because I can't, uh, but I can witness their marriage. So anyway, I witnessed their marriage and somebody gave them a little uh, doll, bride and groom doll that would look like them. So they gave me this for baptizing one of their babies. I said, well, money would have been better. But anyway, I got this nice little doll. So in Olathe, I would uh, take it everywhere, like on vacations. And I would take pictures with this rather than me, because I can't really take a picture of me in the mountains. So I would pose this guy everywhere. So it's Mini FJ is his little name. And uh, the only thing is he has more hair than I do now. Um, but he's kind of cute. So, you know, it's the little things that matter. Um, and the gifts. Somebody brought me a nice big basket full of food and stuff. Got a nice gift here. Somebody made povetitsa. I've got some uh, good old friends of mine, the Kiels, who are here in Lawrence. I knew them from St. Lawrence days. They're very German. Bill uh, taught German here at the university. Uh, so they're bringing me some Spiegelflocken, some, some German cookies uh, here, I think, today or tomorrow. You know, so it's the little things. The little things uh, make a big difference. And... Um, this week especially, I think we should just be mindful of the little things. There's a lot of good blessings in our life. Um, and uh, sometimes those little things, when they're not here, we miss them too. Um, and uh, I think a lot of people are gonna miss some of those little things this Christmas um, because you're not able to be with the people you would normally be with or uh, maybe you're with them in a different way. And I'm not just talking in spirit, um, that's kind of a cliche. But we might be with them you know, on a FaceTime call or a Zoom or uh, just calling people on the phone. Um, I would encourage that because sometimes it's those little things that matter a lot. So um, yeah, everybody, it's um, it's a it's a good week, and uh, I'm just glad to be here at Corpus Christi, and I'm thankful for uh, the not so little things all of our staff does here uh, for all our, for all of you at Corpus Christi and beyond. Uh, we do we do a lot of great things. We have a real good team here, and it's not just our staff, but the many volunteers uh, that I've found here in the parish who help out. Uh, we had uh, taped a beautiful Christmas liturgy that a lot of you are going to be able to watch. It was amazing with a lot of our musicians, um, people who put a lot of work into that. Um, we made it work with all the physical distancing and everything else, so it's pretty amazing. Uh, so, you know, we all look forward to um, the not so little things, the uh, opportunities to get together as a community. Um, I, you know, I'm still waiting to see all the great things that Corpus Christi has to offer. Um, and I've seen a lot already, but there's a lot more to come. So we all look forward to those little things. Um, and um, yeah, just the, the community is really important. So I just wanted to uh, just spend a little time here and just uh, say, you know, what's up this week is, uh, uh, is Christmas. And that's, that's, the, that's the best thing in the world. So um, I really hope you all have a great Christmas time. And um, my homily is talking about listening and watching. I've expanded a little bit. So uh, listening to what Christmas is really all about and uh, watching to see how Christmas can influence other people because it really can. So, um, But anyway, that's, that's it. I'm looking forward to a Christmas and a little break. Hopefully you all are too. Um, so I would just say, you know, try to enjoy the little things. Uh, appreciate them. The little things do matter. Uh, words matter. The little things matter. So uh, make sure you do a lot of good little things for everybody else because uh, that's how we express Christ to other people. So uh, a simple, quick message for to you all this week uh, that I just wish you a Merry Christmas on behalf of our staff and everybody here at Corpus Christi. We wish the same for you. Uh, a blessed Christmas, a Merry Christmas, uh, and um, 
somebody said that I was doing a selfish plug for my last parish, but because uh, I, I talk about the Prince of Peace a lot, uh, and that was my last parish's name, but that's one of the titles given to Jesus uh, at Christmas. Uh, so we do need peace in our world, we need peace in our hearts, and uh, I really do truly believe that it comes through Christ more than anything else. So uh, my, that's my prayer for you all, to have a, a peaceful Christmas, a Merry Christmas, uh, and God bless. So uh, we'll talk to you next week after Christmas. God bless you guys.